Welcome back. Joining me now with details on how they're helping our community's youth become successful adults. Our directors of the Buffalo Police Athletic League. Welcome, Nakia and Ronnie. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for Thank having, you having us. us. Of course. So I want you to start off by just telling us about Buffalo Police Athletic League and what your overall mission is in our community. Well, Buffalo Pal has been around for over 70 years, and our mission is really to work with children in providing educational, recreational programs and partnership with law enforcement. That's right. In mm -hmm. what ways do your programs actually use the law enforcement to help with your mission? So a lot of the police officers are mentors, coaches. Um, it's really important that we begin to build that bond in our community with our law enforcement. So the kids start off at a younger age being able to be accustomed to working with police officers in the community. Nice. Now we have some exciting fall events coming up and programs So tell us about what's going on with the kids this fall. Well, um, we have a we have several programs going on that are free. Did I mention they are free? Yeah. <laughs> free programs. <laughs> and one of them is our Sports Sampling Saturdays, which happens on every Saturday morning at the Hennepin Community Center at 24 Ludington Street. You can drop the kids off at 10 o'clock in the morning. Um, go have fun, take a nap, handle some business, and come back and pick them up about 12.45. Nice. And they get a chance to sample different sports like um, USA Soccer, um, NFL flag, junior NBA basketball, and they can also learn to skate on our synthetic ice skate rink that we have built inside of the community. What? How cool is that? And did she mention that they're free? And they are free. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. What else is going on this fall? And during um, Sports Sampling Saturday, we also do passports around the world with um, Miss Patty. And um, we partner with the Buffalo Bills. Um, they give us food to give to the kids for food security. So the kids get to learn how to do healthy cooking. And they get to take the recipes home. They get to follow it on YouTube. And they get to take a bag of food home that will feed their family like during the breaks. So um, we're, bi we're definitely big on food security and childhood obesity. So we teach them how to make healthier choices. Beautiful. That's going to become the theme for today's show. <laughs> yes. Um, yes. Well, you also have an upcoming podcast program. Tell us about that. Yes. Yeah, so our Teen Voice and Choice um, is a podcast that we do with um, the go-getter, Adri V. <laughs> she, um, she did a, a session with some of our kids earlier this year. So we are looking forward to um, engaging the kids, a new set of kids to learn how to do podcasting and interviewing again this year. Nice. And we can't forget about Play Streets. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, Play Streets, we are out in the parks um, playing with the kids, um, giving them a chance to just be outdoors and just have fun, be kids, mm -hmm. um, enjoy themselves, play soccer. So we will be at the Lincoln Community Center at 10 Quincy. Nice. Tomorrow, bring your kids out. <laughs> uh, you can register them on buffalopal.com or you can bring them right on site and we will register them for these free programs. Free 99. <laughs> okay, why is it important to highlight health and, and sports within the kids in our community? It's important because a lot of our kids don't have nothing to do mm -hmm. or the parents can't afford to put them in programs that are charging mm -hmm. or because the parents are working, they don't really have the time, but we're right there in the park. So we can the neighborhood to let the kids know that we're there and the parents know that the kids are safe mm -hmm. um, with our coaches. We, you know, so I just feel like if people bring their kids to the power programs, their kids will be safe, mm -hmm. their kids will learn, mm -hmm. their kids will get a different type of education. And we definitely promote a lot of self-awareness with our restorative circles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. And did she mention they're all free? And they <laughs> are <laughs> free. <laughs> Ladies, thank you so much for coming in and sharing more about these free programs. Thank Viewers, you. if you would like to learn more about the programs they have to offer all year long, you can visit buffalopal.com. Thanks for coming in, ladies. Thank oh, you. Thank you. Welcome.